scars off fighting the black ones. You're back? Indeed, I am back, sir. Uh, as you can notice, we are on Skellige today, everybody. Um, basically, I, I, I hadn't played this game in so long that I, I kind of forgot who we still had left to play in Novigrad. Um, not that it's important, but I'll get to that in a second. But I did know for sure that there was like roughly 12 individuals still left on the island of Skellige that we had not played. So that's why we are over here. Uh, again, the reason why uh, it doesn't really matter is uh, is because there's only one card left for me to get anyway. So all of these rounds, I, I don't think I'm actually going to get a card, but we'll see. Yearning to play a few rounds of Gwent. That ought to set me straight. However, that being said, there still is one person left uh, back on the mainland that has a card for me. Uh, so we're going to go with the Northern Realms. It's the, uh, you know, tried and true. No real uh, other reason I have for, for using it. Uh, lots of nice spies. Got some good heroes. Um, I'm thinking we probably get rid of Crinford. That's okay. Uh, and we're going to get rid of one of these. Yeah, we're going to get rid of these six siege cards here. It doesn't really matter which one. Ah, uh, we got Crinford back. That sucks. Okay, well, we're going to use our Spy first, as is a customary on the first turn. Shit. Well, that's a bad sign. Uh, well, we'll see what we can do. Hmm, I really don't like... Oh, you bastard. This is going to be tough. Just, just throwing it out there is going to be a little tough. Uh, especially with the Scorch, now that's a 5. I, I know. Oh, you're not going to put it down. Okay. Definitely thought you would put it down. Now there's no reason whatsoever to Scorch anything or anybody. Um, hmm. How do I want to go about this? I think what we do is we just start lining our Siege stuff up. Even if, if uh, you know, they want to Scorch, they're going to take out their own player, at least for now. So we'll we'll play until uh, until she doesn't or he doesn't. Wow. Whoops. Sorry, Mr. Blacksmith. Um, we could clear it off right the right away, or we could just kind of keep going. If um, if they end up passing, we'll you know we'll see what what's going to happen with that. But um, I think at this point it's probably a good idea even to, to lay down the commander's horn, but um, you know. We'll see how that goes. What do you want to do? Okay. Okay. You want to pass? Uh, uh, then I'm not even going to waste the commander's horn if I don't have to, because I'm just going to win. I'm super down in the cards, so that kind of sucks. But we will draw one. Hopefully we get something worthwhile. Uh, man. Okay, well, we're going to have to bank on being able to get a spy from our spy. Oh, yes. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. I, I appreciate that. Yeah, you, you go ahead and you do that. Um, might even be able to get this guy to uh, play a little bit stupid and just keep laying down. Okay, maybe not. He's got that muster. Got that must hard. Uh, okay, so now I have the card lead. The question is, do we exploit it at the moment? Uh, I, I think that that is probably a good idea. Uh, the other good thing that we are going to be able to do is get some stuff in the back. And knowing the Scoia'tael decks... I don't think there's really much that uh, it's going to be able to do against this row of heroes right here. Triss is good and all, but uh, I just don't think that uh, she is particularly powerful. Uh, I, I think our best plan is to just let him have this one, and we'll come back at it next round. He's going to have to lay down another card anyway, so that's another card advantage that we're going to have. 
I'm gonna see how he wants to lead it off. Okay. Makes me really wish I had uh, Valentrenmirth. Valentrenmirth? I think that's his name. Uh, because this would be easy peasy lemon squeezy. Uh, but you know, I'm, I'm feeling it, so yeah, let's uh, let's just put Cirilla down. 15 for 15, eh? Unfortunately, he didn't pull more out of the hand. Ooh, that is that is gross. It's unreasonable. Well, you know, this is when you start crossing your fingers that there's no spies or, or um, you know, other nice things in that deck, like healers. I think all in all, even if this does kind of go south, we, we played it right. Ah, you son of a gun. Ah, uh, okay. Hopefully, that's the only one. Uh, if there is another one, then we might might have some problems. I should I should just shut up, right? I think I think that's the moral of the story. The moral of the story is just don't talk. Don't talk. It's very simple. All right, we'll, we'll protect some of our peoples. Oh, Jesus. Wow. 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 What is wrong with you? Well, we'll just keep trying to push the power that we got. I mean, we're sitting with a pretty, pretty lead right now. A pretty, pretty lead. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, this, this Gwent deck this person's got is pretty fleshed out, if I do say so myself. Ah, oh, really? Are you freaking kidding me? Mm. Okay. Yeah, you know what? I uh... This is where the, the tough part comes in, because I'm going to have to revive something. And it's going to be one of these sixes. Don't get me wrong. Uh, but then it's going to kind of open the whole field up. Now, I could do the Commander's Horn right off the bat, but then that's bad. Again, because it puts our healer above. Uh, I guess if it's going to happen, it's going to happen either way, right? So it's probably best to do this first because if we lose a card we would only lose one card instead of two cards which i don't think we can lose right now oh god oh. okay well we played it right that's what i gotta keep telling myself Can I just do this, even though there's nothing there? No, I can't. Okay. Well, we did what we could. Uh, so unless he's got two tens, we have it. Really? <gasps> yes! Yes! Ah! Okay. Ooh, man, I was worried there. I don't know about you all, but I was legitimately worried. Okay, we got a first scrap. So that tells you right there that uh, we ain't gonna get no more Gwent cards. So uh, considering the Hearts of Stone is gonna come out. Um, oh no, crap, it already came out. Man, I need to get my episodes right. Uh, regardless, let's just mess around a little bit more in Skellige and then we'll go off and uh, do our thing and uh, get Get the very last one that there is. Anyways, guys, I will see you in the next round of Gwent. Ugh. Is it true what they say? You let a black one go free on the last raid. He was but a young lad. Younger than my hair. As I raised my sword... Sorry. See you come from afar. Order replenish your supplies, a wager. 
It's possible, but uh, I think more than supplies, I need some Gwent. Let's get it on, man. I'm going to take your money. You are hopefully a good merchant because too, I'll be a if you're man. not, I'm going to bankrupt you. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. What do I want to do? Uh, well, we could do some Nilfgaard. We could do some monsters. We haven't done Scoytel in a while. Uh, I don't know how well this is going to go. But, uh, yeah, let's do it. Screw it. Monsters. Squito, faction perks allow me to decide who goes first. I'm going to let the opponent start first. That is my general preference. Uh, awesome. And I got that uh, extra card draw as well, so that's very good. And I also have that spy off the very start there. Um, uh, you know what? I think more or less this is a very good starting draw. Uh, so we're going to keep it. See what you're going to do, bub. Oh, really? Yep, I can. Oh, that sucks for you. I can already tell how this is going to go. This is going to be an absolute cakewalk. When you start pulling out ones, it's just like, really? God, you got to be kidding me. Okay. Mr. Kramer. Here we go. We're going to win. Okay. Well, miss what it is. Uh, yeah, okay. So you get to keep one of those guys around. That's phantasmic. Uh, all right. So let's start off with the, um, the commander's horn. Really? I don't... Totally know what that gains him. Mm. But I'm sure it gains him something. Uh, let's also put our commander's horn in the back. And then we'll start going to town. Oh my god. Really? What is this guy's ability? Uh, discard two cards and draw one card of your choice from your deck. That actually isn't too bad of a card to have. Uh, I might want to look into that when I go back to the monster deck. Uh, yeah, let's just start putting down our heroes. Uh, we'll do Yennefer last because I, I, you know, I got some got some designs for her. Yeah, sorry, buddy, that's not going to help you out. Oh, yeah, so that's going to boost everything in the row. So everything is going to be boosted and doubled. So it's going to be pretty awesome, to say the least. Um, let's lay down Miss Siri. And hopefully there's no Scorch in there. There might be. But uh, I don't think it's going to matter too much in the long run. Ah, and pulled some more from his hand. This guy is not having any sort of good luck with this deck. I mean, if he had pulled these guys and, and not the ghoul, things probably would have been okay. But, you know, as luck would have it, he is unfortunately out of it. Yeah, that happens. Okay, the good thing here, though, is he had 14, which means he gets the plus one from here, and then that gets doubled, so that is super bueno. Uh, well, you know, we're just gonna have to do this. I'm gonna put everything in the front that I can like, this is the only thing that's going to have to go in the back here. You coming from the hand, too? Nope. Okay. Well, you got lucky. You got lucky, punk. Place this one. And, uh, you know, I I'm just going to go for it. I, I think our... What's our record? Like, 154? Something like that? Uh, I don't know how close we're going to be able to get to that, but, I mean, these are... This actually makes me re think the effectiveness of the Squirtle deck. I always considered it really weak. Uh, but this, this, this totally changes it. I mean, it was a fantastic draw right off the bat. Yeah, we're not going to make it, I don't think. Well, maybe. Well, it was worth it. 135, that's still really, really good. Um, just total schlocking. Sorry, Mr. Merchant. All right, we'll, we'll stick around just to see if we can get uh, a card. Like cats. 
Wow, I don't even get like a first scrap. The blacksmith was a lot nicer than you, man. All right, everybody. So what we're going to do is we're going to leave Skellige here. I, I know that I talked about we had a whole bunch of people that we hadn't played, and that is true. However, uh, I, I think if I'm right on this one, Hearts of Stone has already come out. And there's other Gwent to be played. So what we're going to do is we're just going to go complete this Collect Them All quest. Uh, and then that way I'll be all good to go by the time the new expansion comes out. And we can try and get some of those uh, Gwent episodes out as quick as possible with those shiny new cards. And we can use Skellige as a farming ground for those. Considering there's still are, uh, there are still so many players that we haven't played yet. So I will see you guys over in Vizima. That's all you got for me? That's all you got for me? I'll let you guys in on a little bit of secret here. When they first start you off in this game, no spoilers, I'll try and avoid them, they bring you to this place. And they show you that little quest exclamation mark, and you're like, oh man, this is great. I'm going to start this off, and he's like, oh hey, you want to play some Quint? And you're like, oh yeah, I just heard about this game, this is awesome. Everybody in White Orchard was awesome. They were so easy. And then this guy kicks your ass so hard. I will let you know that this entire series is because of this one man. My quest to become the very best. And we're not going to mess around. We're going the full 10. We're going the full 10. I know this is going to be rough. Wouldn't mind a few rounds but we're going to do it. And uh, as wonderful as our last round with the Squirtle deck was, and as much as I don't like to keep reusing the Northern Realm deck, it is a necessity at this point. So we're going to use it. And hopefully, crossing our fingers, we get some really good draws, because we are going to freaking need it. Really? I thought... Okay, so he's Nilf Guardian Empire. Oddly enough, I had the uh, impression that he was actually... Um, going to be Northern Realms. I thought that's what he was. Could be mistaken. Anyway, so let's get rid of Krenfred. Okay, that's fine by me. We have two spies, which is nice. Uh, we have our Scorch, which is going to be really, really nice seeing some Nilf Guardians with so many 10s. Uh, and so many 10s, rather, that are not heroes. And these decoys should be pretty useful in case he wants to lay down any spies of his own. Um, yeah, other than that, we're definitely going to get rid of one of these guys. Can't really get too hurt. Oh, yes. Okay, so we're, 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 we're sitting pretty damn good here. We are sitting pretty damn good. So let's do this. Uh, if need be, we can throw the first round. I'm not really super worried about it. Uh, I would like another spy, though. That would be really good. Uh, got three random cards. Okay. You, 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 you know, you go do that, man. Ooh. Okay, well, that kind of ruffled my feathers a bit. Um. I mean, I would like to win it. Let's, uh, let's just... Screw it. Let's just go for it. What's the worst that's going to happen here? Yep. Okay. That, that honestly is fine by me. Because he's just going to play that and we'll decoy it. Play it. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Do some decoying of my own. I ain't gonna just sit here and let that happen on, on my watch. Okay, so... Um, uh, normally what I would do is I would play uh, our... Our, our spy card here, but there's no real reason. We're going to win it, we're going to get a card, and then we can just play the spy again. I, I guess it happens either... Well, no. Eh, no, you know what? Maybe... Eh. Well, we're going to win, so we... I don't know. Uh, whatever. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. It, it probably actually would have been better to play him on that last round, but since we won and we have to play a card first anyway, I might as well just play this spy. Now, it sucks that he has attack, and I'm going to be contributing to this guy's strength. Uh, granted, it's not going to be that much. All 
Alrighty, I don't remember this. Well, I guess in the beginning, it's this deck is pretty crazy, but I don't remember it being this kind of nonchalant. Uh, anything we, no, we don't. You know, I think it's probably best that we just don't really uh, use those guys a whole lot. Mm. I think probably what we can do is maybe some tomfoolery with our decoy. Maybe we try and get above eight and then just try and get him to play another card. I think we scorch him. No, 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 no. That's a bad idea. Mm. Well, let's see what we can do. We'll just pass. We'll let him take that one, and then he'll come in. He's got to play it, and then it's going to be 12 to 8 on the beginning cards. Okay, so he didn't have another decoy. That's good. Uh, if he has a spy, I think it's only going to hurt him to use it now. Okay. Uh, yep. I see what you're doing. Good thing we saved this, right? Jeez, no tomfoolery for me. Boom. Uh, the only thing that could really hurt us is if he has more medics. Um, that would not be fun to deal with. Okay, so he definitely has that Zeracanian nonsense, the, the heavy scorpion or whatever it is. Oh, good. We got Stennis. Oh, oh, I will take it. I will take it for sure. Oh, yeah. All right. Yep. Let's just start laying down the heroes. I mean, there's, there's nothing left we can do. Uh, in terms of delaying rounds or anything like that, but we have a huge six card advantage right here. Yep, saw that one coming a mile away. Uh, but we'll, we'll keep this guy, you know, on the ready in case there is something that comes down here that's a little bit more heavy hitting. Um, but, you know, this kind of negates a widespread effect of our, of our Scorch, but all in all, it's not super terrible. Um, and since this is shielding everything from a Scorch, let's just start doing this stuff. And we'll get the six back. But we're definitely going to light up this back row. Just you wait and see. Boop. Come on, bub. Let me lay my cards down. You can kind of see how, just as a starting deck, this, this is a little too much to handle. Um, you know, and I was even using spies and stuff like that. But when you can lay down this many points just right off the bat at the start of the game, uh, there's... Oh, thank God. So we avoided some, some troubles there. I'm just going to lay everybody down and see what happens. Okay. I'm going to pass, eh? Well, I'm going to just start going ham on you then. Let's see what happens. It'd be awesome if I had the uh, the other one there. Yeah, this is going to eat that. There we go. Woo hoo hoo hoo. Uh, okay, so we, we're, we're not going to make it. But again, we should, we should make it pretty good. 138. That's... That's pretty nice. Def oh, look, and we made like a little arrow. Cool. All right, guys. So uh, let's see what we get. Uh, you're a barbarian. Got the full test card. Now, are we going to see something pop up here? Boom. Collect them all is completed. Oh, yes. All right. We did finish the collect them all. But that is not going to be the end of this Gwent series, everybody. So I hope you come is back true? next Northern Sunday. And hopefully by then, we will have some new Hearts of Stone cards ready for you to, to oogle at. Anyways, guys, I hope you have a good week. Uh, I know that I will. Uh, and otherwise, guys, I hope you have a good day, good night, whatever it is to you. Blah, 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 blah. 
Uh, enjoy your life. And all that it has to offer. You should get to the point where anyone else would like it. And you're not gonna stop there! No! What are you waiting for? Subscribe! Just...